If you're trying to redeem an Xbox gift card, but you're having problems getting it to work, this video may help. Most issues revolve around this screen, where people enter the code and try to redeem it. I already covered the basics of using this screen in a separate video, and I'll put a link to it in the description. If this screen isn't accepting your code, the first thing you need to think about is whether or not you're entering it in correctly. When I had issues here, it was because I was getting the G's and 6's mixed up. If you have a physical gift card, make sure there's no silver residue blocking part of the letters. Don't type in any of the other numbers that appear on the back of the card. Also make sure you're not typing in the dashes that are in the code because those get automatically added to the screen as you type. Hitting the like button on this video may also help. It could be that the code you're trying to redeem is not an actual Xbox gift card code. If you have a game specific code, you normally have to redeem that somewhere besides the Xbox interface. For example, this Roblox gift card has to be redeemed on the Roblox website. For some games, this can get very complicated. Redeeming it on the game's website may be the first step, but then you may get a notification with a different code that you do have to go through the Xbox interface to use. Either way, whatever code you attempt through the Xbox interface needs to be 25 digits long, and it will not contain any of the characters seen here. Xbox may also be having server issues at the time you try to redeem your code. In the description of this video, I'll put a link that allows you to check the server status. It's possible that something went wrong during the checkout process when you bought the code. If you bought it in a brick and mortar store, the cashier may not have activated the card properly. Or perhaps you bought two gift cards and the cashier scanned one of them twice and they totally missed the other. So that second card did not activate. Check with the store if this is a concern. Even if the cashier did it right, the activation may need 24 hours to go into effect, according to Microsoft. It could be that the code you are attempting to use has already been redeemed. Maybe you did the process a while back and forgot about it, or maybe someone in your household has used it. You can look at your history and see if something was redeemed on your account. Go to your Xbox dashboard, click settings, account, go to payment and billing, and order history. It defaults to showing orders for the last month, but you can change that right here. For me, it says Microsoft account credit, and I can select that to get a little bit more detail. It doesn't show me the actual code though. You can get to a similar screen on the Xbox website, sign in, click your little avatar symbol in the top right, then select my Microsoft account, then go down to order history. It could be that someone has stolen your code and redeemed it before you got to redeem it on your end. It could also be that you got scammed and bought a fake code from someone pretending to sell a real one. If you suspect something criminal, contact the store where you bought it or contact Xbox themselves. This next point is very important. The region your account is registered needs to match the region the gift card was bought from. So if you have a Canadian account, you cannot redeem a code bought in the US. You have to create a US account to redeem it. It's possible to change your Xbox region, but I have never done that and a lot of people recommend against doing it because it can cause issues. There's also some way to redeem it using a VPN, but I have never attempted to do that. Microsoft also says that some codes can't be redeemed if your Microsoft account is suspended or has a balance due. You'll need to call them and get that resolved before moving forward. That's all I have today. Let me know if the video helped you or not. If you wanna see the basics of redeeming an Xbox gift card code, click the video link on the screen. Have a good day, everybody.